Good afternoon. So here is my tortilla wrap. Looking good here. It's a tortilla wrap. Yeah, it's a green tortilla wrap actually. Um Yeah, I made it earlier with a hum hummus and with some leftover veggies like carrots as you can see and alfalfa sprout again turmeric tofu um, broccoli here you can see inside have broccoli as well and other stuff is like a beans so it's like a it's one is like lima beans some like kidney beans and i'm not sure about this one i think pinala or something like that just all the beans here just like this one is uh, i boiled in hot water until it's soft yeah it's good enough to eat and I sprinkle with some dried herbs basil dried basil and again here's with the black hummus and some uh, broccoli it's a cook not a roll and this one I I slice it at, as a triangle so this one is pan fried tortilla chips uh, without oil so yeah it's healthier but it's quite crispy see even it's not deep fried with oil or back uh, back in grill in oven so it's still crispy and this one i made it a uh, two version one is a square and one is a triangle so hmm, yeah I I think I just finish all the alfalfa sprouts and the black hummus from the last week video is my last batch of black hummus and I think so I think I heat in a pan in a pan quite long so that it turned into brown his brown color. So this one is actually soft wrap tortilla with some veggies. Yeah, it's quite nice. Um, I think it's it will be nice if will be. It, if it eaten like this one sorry guys if I it was so, sometimes so clumsy <laughs> and yeah sometimes silly question and this one I put the beans here well you just a uh, finger bite food actually but you can eat it as a snack or maybe brunch or whatever lunch or dinner but actually yeah i made it for my brunch so here i try give a bite mm. it's nice so i'll give it a try to this one a tortilla carrot the turmeric tofu, broccoli, um, I slice it um, carrot for the julienne slices, which is like the match match stick shape, and again the alfalfa sprout, <laughs> the last one, and I put some beans from here, we and the turmeric tofu again, so. Let's try. Mm. I 
you're so good, oh my god. Even I didn't put any seasoning like salt or maybe olive oil, it still still tastes, I mean it still tastes pretty good. And of course, this one is absolutely holy, delicious, and of course, it is made easy made, easily made, and yeah, less less effort to prepare. I think this will be more creative if you put some other veggies, maybe mushroom, or maybe. Yeah, for you, the one who not, um, maybe cannot eat dairy food, but you still love egg, yes, please do add some hard boiled egg. For me, personally, I, I don't like uh, egg yolk, so I prefer more the white egg. Yeah, I love it so much. Actually, from the humus, it is already seasoning with a lemon, mm, garlic, and of course, the main ingredients is a tahini. Tahini is a, a roasted sesame seed and then blitz into a few minutes until you get the creamy texture and voila you get the tahini as a dressing for salad or of course the main ingredients for the hummus itself okay so other veggies i think will be creative like tempeh because i saw it before like holy healthy restaurant or healthy conscious store which is selling food they have menu called tempeh wrapped and the tempeh itself may be seasoning with a organic liquid smoke or and the tempeh itself is a non-gmo which is organic and it is healthier version than regular which is salt which is sell in traditional market and other than alfalfa sprout I found there is a amaranth the amaranth is similar to the beans I mean the mang bean sprout or the alfalfa sprout so it's like sprouts family yeah it's like microgreens or maybe you can add asparagus or yeah as many as you like i mean your favorite veggies like tomatoes hmm, spinach kale or mushroom like enoki mushroom others yeah the sky is the limit so as go as creative as you are so don't hesitate to 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 get yourself healthy healthy stuff hmm. Actually, other than black hummus, I'm finding it in Google. They have a lot of variant of hummus, like made it from edamame or maybe um, 
paprika, edit a sweet potato, carrot. I guess if they put like roasted paprika or carrot, maybe the enter merek, the color will be orange. And if you add the tahini, is a white tahini, the color is just a regular. It's the plain, plain hummus, which the color is white instead of black. If you love spicy food, you can add a smoked paprika or a chili. <clears throat> See, the closer itself, it's the texture is not that smooth. It has some bite. He has some bite, the small bite. Um. Again, homemade tiny, homemade hummus is more way healthier than the store version of hummus. And I didn't realize that this almost two weeks I eat hummus uh, always. So it's like Actually, it's not my staple food because I love to I love to explore and try new recipe. But well, not that professional as other vegan raw eater out there, which is uh, famous in on Instagram or vlogger in YouTube. So I'm just a beginner here, <laughs> so pardon myself for being too confident for my creation of my own cooking. Um, yeah, I think broccoli is uh, good for your healthy because it contains some vitamin, mineral, and of course the broccoli itself it's good for your bones and for your constipation so if you are veggie vegan i mean if you're a vegetarian or vegan please do add some broccoli to your dietary food because it is replace the milk as we grow older we don't need as much as kids do for the milk dairy milk from cow because our body already has that system to digest more more food more variant food like this one this this kind of meal so i guess it is better for us to drink non-dairy food I mean non-dairy milk like maybe soy milk almond milk or even other nuts milk maybe hazelnut or cashew or maybe rice milk I don't know what you guys think about it um, Or if you love the Italian style, you can go for pesto dressing, which is made from pine nuts, lemon, mm, salt, pepper, I think, and olive oil, extra virgin olive oil. Or you can add vegan cheese 
and voila that's it the the ingredients for pesto once i made it before the pesto itself it is really good you can make it with pasta gnocchi or maybe other salad maybe or sandwich or maybe like this one is tortilla wrapped yeah this is good and enjoy uh, if you like my youtube channel please do like and subscribe and leave some comment below please visit my blog as well it's uh, michellecarissa.blogspot.co.id and have a blessed day guys have peace saturday and god bless you all bye